Hi everyone, I'm Kaj, and in this tutorial I'll be talking about the Sony A7S folder structure and where to locate your video files. Alright, let's get busy! The Sony A7 records in three different file formats. The XAVC-S, which has the best image quality, the ABC-HD, and the MP4. Within the root folder, each file format is stored in its own folder but the names of the folders are intuitive, which is why you need to know the path to get to your video clips, especially if you enable dual video recording. Dual recording allows you to simultaneously record two different file formats at the same time, so each file format is stored in a separate folder. All right, so let's start with the XAVCS files. Where are they located? Open the root folder. You should now see two subfolders, one named AVC Info, which is grayed out, and the other Private. Double click on Private. Within the Private folder, you will see three subfolders. Click on the M4 root, then click on the Clip folder. There you go. The XAVCS files under the MP4 video. You can also see the size of the file. This file is about 18 megabytes. By the way, the XAVCS uses the MP4 file wrapper for its HD and proxy files. You can also rename the files to whatever you like. Now, to locate the AVC HD files, just click on the private folder then the AVCHD subfolder. Now click on the BDMV folder. Then finally the stream folder. Again, the files can be renamed to whatever you like. If you look over to the right, the file size is about 3.8 megabytes. Now here's a trick question. In which folder is the MP4 files located? If you chose Sony, you're wrong. When you select the MP4 file format, two new folders are created in the root directory. The DCIM and the MP root folder. Now click on the MP root folder, then the 100ANV01 folder. By the way, I have no idea why they call it that. There it is. Here's the file type, MP4, and here's the file size, about 1.5 megabytes. Before I wrap up this tutorial, I want to quickly show you my workflow. What I usually do is import my clip folder into my project media window. Let me show you. Okay, so let me open up Premiere Pro. I'll right click here, import. I'll select the M4 root directory, then the clip folder, import folder. Uh oh. If you see this, don't panic, let me explain. The error message is just telling you that the extension .xml files couldn't be imported. That's okay, they're not needed anyway, so you could just blow this off. Now double click on the clip folder, and voila! Here are my three files, my three XAVCS files. I had renamed this file earlier to my desk, and it still works. Just a side note, if you select dual video recording in camera settings, you have only two options to choose from, either record both XAVCS and MP4 simultaneously or AVCHD and MP4. 
If you select MP4 as your file format, dual video recording will be disabled. Sony has put together a XAVC workflow guide, which you can download from their website. You can also download their free Catalyst browser, which will help you browse and locate your files. Well, that's it. And as they say here in Brooklyn, bada bing, bada boom. Anyway, I hope my short tutorial was informative. I'll be posting more free tutorials on my website along with tips and reviews. And while you're there, don't forget to subscribe to my mailing list. Mm -mm -mm. Once again, I'm Kaj and thanks for watching.